Active soil depressurization systems operate by creating a vacuum under the foundation. However, they can also pull air from inside the house via leaks in the foundation, such as slab joints and plumbing penetrations. Whenever practical, one should seal these openings with polyurethane caulk to make the system work better and to reduce the loss of conditioned interior air. To seal a slab's wall joint, vacuum up loose debris and apply a thick bead of caulk. Using a piece of cardboard, smooth the caulk into the joint so it goes up on the wall and onto the floor by at least 3 eighths of an inch. If the slab is poured tightly to the wall, as in a cold joint, you should also caulk these joints if they are accessible. If you have control joints that are exposed, and especially if they are cracked, it would be a good idea to caulk these as well. Another major leak point can be plumbing penetrations. To seal these, cut back any expansive material and apply caulk completely around the base of the penetration and tool the caulk into the joint. Other places to seal can be blockouts for tubs and showers, as well as installing a gasketed and bolted lid on an interior sump, regardless if you are applying your system vacuum to it or not. It is typically not necessary to remove wall treatments to caulk joints, but rather caulk those you can access, but you should always conduct a backdraft test on combustion appliance vents to assure they are working properly.